Don't worry about it. Just start talking. I mean, yeah, this is great. This is here we stuff. are again. We are, you always do this. You're so seasoned. So we know everything now. We've, we've been doing this for, so I don't know. I'm back. just going to stand here and you guys talk. No, we're asking no. you. How does it feel to be back? Hi, Todd. This is incredible. It's been two years since we've been back filming. What, what's so, that behind you? Um, the Haunted Wolf Manor, the, the notorious Clovis Sanitarium. You missed us, didn't you? I missed you guys a lot. You were going to cry. Don't, I know. When Seriously. we start talking about the show, it started getting me all choked up. Is that like right like your it's, eye? Yeah, it's like it's, we're saying goodbye to Donna for some reason, and it's I know. she's a big Donna's part here. of our past. A lot has happened. Though. When's the last time we filmed you? Two years ago. About two years ago. Two, you see? Yeah, and I've gotten tons happened. of emails and stuff from people over Facebook and Twitter, and when are you guys filming again? And so with Donna moving out of state, I thought it was a great opportunity to uh, bring her back and all of us kind of have a reunion. Thousands of people, yeah. to attest to that, have been through this place yeah. and recorded so much evidence that again Wolf Manor became noted as one of the most haunted locations in North America. Anyway, we're here to yeah. do it again and we're gonna see Donna tonight. Right. And we're gonna do our thing again. It's been a while. Yeah. I miss you man. I know. <laughs> without being without being too emotional. Yeah. She's leaving the boys. Yeah. She's like Mama Bird. Yeah. She got all this started. You got it all going on in there. And now it's our turn to Yeah. To fill her shoes, which are impossible. Right. We're not sensitive. She's leaving the boys alone, and she's leaving, and we won't see her for, long well, you'll time. probably see her, but for a long time. Right. It's going to be a long time. And I can't, can we do this? It's like a day, of the first day of the job. Yeah. We always knew that we had Donna <laughs> two hours away. Right. Donna, you know, hey. Something's crazy. You better, better get down here. Need, yeah. yeah, we need to do something. Yeah. Now she's moving far away. It's like. She can't just pop in. We don't in. have time. Yeah. See, just creepy. That smell. Yeah. Yep. That's what men do. Still here. Three grown men. Tom's back here. I can hear her voice. There she is. Yeah. Are we scary? Well, it's weird because um, I'm hearing more bit of audible. Mm -hmm. So uh, I heard a woman um, singing or talking upstairs, okay. like audibly. And then as I was upstairs running around, um, I somebody was like following me. And I was hearing like shuffling on the ground and the floors were moving right where I was. And every time I'd move it, I'm just like, okay, I'm going back downstairs. <laughs> <laughs> we were just outside were asking. Were you frightened then? Um, only because it sounded so real. I mean, that sounds stupid. Um, I usually get stuff and I usually get energies and that's what I deal with. I don't deal with audible a lot. Okay. So to have somebody like right so where I was. You something like going, how you doing? I mean, that, 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 yeah, that's what you Yeah, it was just like right with me and um, was not a comfortable feel. And I've never heard you talk about an audible. No, I don't do. I don't get a lot of audibles, you know. So. Um, and we were way, you know, to, to let everybody know, like we were way out in the field, just talking. So yeah. you, you yeah. wouldn't have heard us. No. no. Donna, when you say audible, will you explain what you mean when you say audible? You? My, I heard them with my ears. Oh, okay. So, um, so yeah. So it, it was, you know, it was like. It, it, it was really calm in here, so I don't know how long it's been since somebody's been in here, anybody. So I'm like, oh shoot, nothing much. But when I went into Mary's room, first thing was a man standing there, which is what I normally get, which is energy. Um, and he was like there, and he was asking me about a Bible. Um, and I'm like looking in drawers, something about a Bible. And then, uh, and then Mary was kind of there, but not a lot. Usually she's right there. But she was, somebody was happy I was making the bed. So I was making the bed and just having a conversation, and they were really happy I was making the bed because it was messy and there were stuff on it. Um, and then I started just walking around from room to room and I kept thinking, God, I feel like I'm being followed. And then I thought, oh, I wonder if you know, a real person was in here. Because I knew you guys weren't in here. Mm -hmm. And then I kept hearing like shuffling and it would be right where I was. In Mary's room. All over. All over. So it started yes. when I got out in the hallway. 
And then I went to say hi to George, uh, which he was really not there much either, which was surprising to me too, because every time I've come, there he is, and I thought, oh, I'm gonna say, it's been a long time since I've been here. And, um, but I kept getting, it wasn't him, and it was somebody shuffling, and somebody like, they, they were getting a kick out of me getting a bit jumpy about it. You know, because I, I was worried that it was actually a person who had gotten in here sure. and was like hiding. And, but then I knew, no, they couldn't stay up with me without me seeing them, because I was in the, um, oh, the big, the day room, you know, oh, the yeah, one yeah, yeah. And um, so I was going to go see if I could smell the baby powder, because I always smell baby powder there. It didn't smell that. But I kept creaking, and the floor was moving, like somebody was adjusting and shuffling like that. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> and they kept following me and kept staying with me. I'm like, I'm going downstairs. And then at least I can yell out a, wi a window. Going, so, that, hey. so, so that's <laughs> why you were downstairs. Why well, yeah, I thought, I'm just going to do some stuff down here and see <laughs> down right, here. So it's very, uh, very um, abnormal for us to hear you being uncomfortable. I know. So you were looking for a Bible. Is that really important to you? Did you lose a Bible? Light up the lights for us. Did you get that? Yeah. Do you think that came from outside? Possibly. Did you lose a Bible? Light up the lights for us. Did you lose a Bible? Light up the lights for us. Did you lose a Bible? Light up the lights for us. Did you hear that? So we just heard a voice. A little voice. It sounded pretty tinny though, didn't it? Yeah. Over on this wall? Yeah, right by your right flip. It's right, right here. Oh, okay. This is where we, we, we caught it. We've been told a lot of different things, but we don't know. Do you have a lot of stuff with you, Scott? Um, do you have a lot of things you picked up in your travels? I do. I'm getting you have a lot of things around you. Um, I've been to a lot of places in the last six months. It's like, um, they're like, they're like, uh, do you ever feel really tired in your shoulders? All the time. And back on your neck? Mm -hmm. You need to get rid of those. Okay. Um, they're, they're sucking you. Um, I've been more angry now than I've been in my yeah, entire life. you need to get them yeah. gone. I yell at other drivers when I used to not care about that stuff. So. Right. Yeah, that's Interesting. bad. You've got a lot of, like, leeches hanging from you. Do of... I get rid of those easily? or? Do yeah, I... as long as you know that they're there, you can picture it and you can start removing them. I need to start removing them. But um, it'll help a lot because it's, it's, it's draining you. They're draining you really slowly. Thank you. Because I thought, oh, I've got something. But then as soon as you walked over, I'm like, then you walked away. I'm like, no, you've got a bunch of stuff around you. I've been looking around the United States recently about all kinds of weird stuff. That was weird. What was that? My phone. I'm, oh, I'm oh okay. I'm so I'm not getting anything here. Facebook live. So no. do you, is it elemental? Is that the word that we, we yeah. would use? So okay. it's, it's not evil, but it's not a good thing either. So, you know, a lot of people think demonic. It's not demonic. It's just a lower base entity that um, uh, probably would cause problems. Maybe you, like trip somebody, trip somebody down the stairs. Um, you know, do kind of mischievous things. It's not a good thing, but it's not the walking evil either. So it's just something you don't want around. So what's its motivation? Um, Is there an animal or doesn't know any better? Or? No, it's very low based, so it doesn't have a whole lot of um, understanding other than you're somebody to mess with. So it's not like a thinking, in our terms, it's not like a thinking human spirit. It's a lower based I always call them idiots because they basically are just, they're, they're, they're like two-year-olds. So they're, they're ignorant to a lot of stuff. They're just, yeah. They're just, they're just doing what they're wired to do, which is to mess with you, to make you feel uncomfortable, to make you feel miserable. And they do that. Yeah. yeah. You feel anything else weird? Is there something in your pants? No, I mean... Is he getting pissed off? Um, well, yeah, I, was just I really feel uh, like I'm being. Um, is something going to be nice to you right now? Someone being nice to you? Not. Not nice like to you. um, like we said about the feeling of being the new kid at school feeling. You see, with you, Scott, because I get he's focused on you, Scott. Okay. Because they can read you in a second and know your whole history. All right. 
So what he's doing is he's trying to figure out how to get you, to, how to intimidate you. Because he knows I'm easily intimidated. Yeah, and he also knows that you have a whole lot of crap with you. You're easily intimidated. What if I give this I think you feeling of uh, dominance or not provoking? Well, not provoking, but walking out of the prison yard like like a badass. Yeah. For some reason, now I don't feel so bad. In other words, if you if you if you're just or you know, stat, uh, posturing to him that you know I'm not thinking. Weird concept, I'm, though. He's trying to he see he's coming to me. He's trying to he's trying to get you to get in a rage. Uh, in a rage? rage? Yeah, in a rage. To get angry, to get in a rage, because he's picking that up from you. But I don't want to do that. No, you don't want to. I'm just saying yeah. that he wants. He's trying to figure out how to get to you to get you to go in a rage. Oh, that's not gonna work. Is that clicking sound you? Am I what now? That clicking sound, was that you just now? Did it sound like Starshine dust? I mean, you can do it again. Do what again? The Starshine, do whatever it was. You just I did, did nothing. I heard a click, I click, I behind you. It's more psychological. I'm serious. So what are you feeling well, right now, Scott? Just like, I feel like I'm uh, being played. You are. A weird This feeling. is what this guy does. Okay, so why do you want to, why do you want to do that? The minute I, I think like, you know, um, if I go into the mode, like say I caught my kid smoking, he doesn't smoke, he never has, but you know, like a dad being mad at his kids, right. all of a sudden I feel okay. Yeah. You know, but at the moment I start thinking that I'm that kid that weighed his bed till he's 12 years old and it was picked on in school and all that kind of stuff, I, I'm, it's like I can control it. Yeah. It's very strange. Yeah. Does anybody remember Donna? What is that? I thought that was you up against them. No. Was it behind you? That was behind you. No. Oh. That's behind you. Oh, it's got, it's got to be the wind on something, yeah? There's no wind out there. No, there is wind. I mean, there's a breeze out there. Does anybody remember Donna? What is that? Does anybody remember Donna? What is that? Does anybody remember Donna? What is that? Hello? Okay, I have never, I've, I've been coming here for years. You've never heard that? I've never heard that. Well, what, explain the noise. It's in the corner now. I am not kidding. That's no, starting behind Donna and it moved. See, that's what I was hearing up here. This corner. So it's, we call it shuffler. Let's, let's we're, dumb shuffler. Boys. We're, we're dumb boys, but we just, I mean, we don't have the lack of a better name. What, what is that? Did you hear that? I hear it clicking. No, you didn't hear that behind Donna? It, it's, it's like this, I, I thought it was outside, but that's what I was hearing was it would start over in the corner behind me here, uh -huh. and then it would move. Right there. I think that. It's in the corner. Yeah. Are you filming this? Hmm. So over in the corner from oh. me. Do you hear that? Yeah. Okay. You have our attention. What? Who's moving what? on the floor, creaking? I'm standing. I'm standing right here next to you. And I'm, I'm, Donna's right there. I'm, Todd's back over behind you. And I'm, I'm shut. I'm, I'm doing this to make sure it's not me with the weight. So what's? Oh, look at that though. This paper here is moving, or whatever that is. Let's walk over there, Terry. Get Terry. Get Terry. So something behind there is moving. See? It sounds like the floor creaking on the wall. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna huh? Terry, poke your head off. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, it's there. Oh, it's there. This one right here. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Hit it, bro. See what you're moving? The weight you're doing? That's the noise I'm hearing. Wait, there was no one over here. Well, I know there was no one over, but that's the noise. I'm just trying. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to figure out what the hell it is. You start talking every time. It oh. What the hell is that? It's moving. The phone is moving. <laughs> it says insu 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 phone. 
So the phone is moving. It's the breeze, huh? It's the interphone. It's that phone sucking yeah. up and down. God, that was, yeah. but I thought I heard it behind you over here. No, I did hear something behind me. Oh, that's too Oh, that just wigged me out. Okay. <laughs> the insulation phone? Yeah. Yeah, or what we like to call in the industry as the info phone. Instant go. So what about side of it, though? My board. Oh, so it's it, somehow a little breeze is getting in there? <laughs> oh, man, that is, we know what it is now. Man, that was Scott, tricky. Scott, you should over here to watch this thing go. It's completely dark, and it's making look at this. Yeah. It's hysterical. It's almost like this, uh, one of these minor contraptions from the thing. Dude, you can't tell me that wasn't freaky. Like what? Stick your head out the window. Hell no. And then we heard that weird it sound gasping, right Hospital gasping, patient gasping, or do you think it's something trying to communicate with us now? I mean, I don't know. When we, when we heard that EVP, we heard that. We also heard something. Well, over there again. Yeah. Yeah, in that same corner. Yeah. Right over the other corner. Yeah. The, uh, the north, uh, you know, was that northeast? That corner. Okay, so that corner. <laughs> the bad corner, go to the corner. Okay, so yeah. we're all, I think we're on to something. Okay. We're on to something. Yeah. <laughs> so the northeast quadrant of the room. So, uh, subsector Z. <laughs> did you, did you do that? The freaks yeah. me out as a giggle. Yeah. Wait, did you hear that, Todd? Yeah. So, uh, subsector Z. <laughs> Did you, say, oh, you do that? The freaks yeah. me out as a giggle. Yeah. So, uh, subsector Z. <laughs> Did you say, oh, you do that? So, uh, subsector Z. <laughs> Did you say, oh, you do that? Wait. Did you hear that, Todd? Yeah. Hello? Did you want to come in the conversation? We'll talk to you. Are you glad we're here? Did you hear that? No, that's that thing. That's that thing. Oh, because I'm like, when I'm here and something, I call out a Terry over no, here. No, I heard a whisper. I, I heard it. It was a giggle to me. No, but no, just now, just before, I heard a whisper. Were we all talking or were you just talking? When I said, the last thing I said, then I heard a whisper below it. So I want to stand over here only so I can get to the that styrofoam so it doesn't look like a Yeah. Because that keeps getting messed. That should be Yeah, okay. Do you want to talk to us? Can we help you in any way? Do you remember my friend Bill who was here? We did an investigation, you made the papers move? Are you here with me? Are you here with me? Are you here with me?
Punch down room. Punch room. Punch down 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 room.
I appreciate that video. Too. Right there. Yeah, what was that? So they sound like it said Donna. How are we doing here? Did it? Yeah. Did. Wow. did it? Yep. It did. Oh god, I love this stuff. <clears throat> See now I'm excited. This is Todd. We're doing an EVP session. Turn the light out, Todd. I'm mm -hmm. videotaping. Oh. How are we doing in here? Good. <clears throat> See now I'm excited. Right there. <gasps> Okay, wait, go, go, go. It says Donna. Ready? ready? Yeah, after he says I'm videotaping. Yeah. Okay. This is Todd. We're doing an EVP session. Turn the light out, Todd. I'm videotaping. How are we doing in here? Good. Whoa! How are we doing in here? Y'all know I'm leaving. You know that? Wow. Sent you off. That was a good one. Now the time Can you mark that time? Yeah. File 39. File 39. That was like a class of 8 with 25, 24 seconds. That's clear as a bell. Right there. Flat out. <laughs> Flat out. That was your name. <laughs> Is that what they call class A? Yeah, that was a class A. Yeah. That was easily a class A. Yeah. You have you you live out of town, you you live you know up in the Bay Area, so we we never got to see you that often, but when we did, boy, what a bang. It was awesome. So yeah. thank you so much for everything. Good luck to you. Thank you. I can't say anything because I'll cry. I know. Just Doug was ditto. You're um you're leaving these three young dumb boys, and, and you know when we say dumb boys, we don't mean it like that. We mean it just you. Uh, you're like a, a mama bird, <laughs> and we're yeah. trying to fly out of this big wooden nest in, in Fresno, and it's Clovis. You know, Clovis, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm all about. Where are we? Yeah. Clovis. Yeah. You're all about geography. We're all about geography. Well, you're the one in the northeast room. Come on, give me a break. So, yeah. Uh, anyway, I hope everybody yeah. enjoyed the show tonight. I'm Todd Wolf, and I appreciate you watching the Haunted Wolf Manor live. Yeah. Okay, we're one, two, three. Are you quite done? I already did it. No, let's do it one more time. Just, oh. just, just. I'm Todd Wolf, and thank you for watching the Haunted Wolf Manor live. Terry. I'm Terry Campbell, and you're watching the Haunted Wolf Manor live. I'm Scott. I'm Donna. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Thank Good you night. for watching you again. Bye. Bye.